Use of photoplasmography to predict mortality intensive care units. Introduction Purpose Photoplasmography is an optical non-invasive technique that monitors the pulse wave, capturing the variation in peripheral blood volume. This device can provide information on hemodynamic parameters at bedside and assist in the prognosis in intensive care units. The aim of this study was to evaluate and compare the capacity to predict hemodynamic variables obtained with photoplasmography and a page 2 in patients hospitalized intensive care units. Materials and methods A prospective court study was conducted in the adult ICU of Hospital Nossa Senhora da Conceição, located in Tubarão, Santa Catarina, Brazil. Data collated included the diagnosis for hospitalization, age, gender, clinical or surgical profile, photoplasmography pulse curve signal, and a PASH2 score in the first 24 hours. A bivariate and multivariate logistical regression was performed with death and then outcome. A mortality model using artificial neural networks was proposed. Results 190 individuals were evaluated. Most of them were elderly, male, and main reasons for fertilization were cardiovascular and neurological causes. Half of them were surgical cases. Median length of stay was of 6 days, EPAT2 median score was 14, and 28.4% of the subjects died. The following factors were associated to mortality. Age, clinical profile, a page 2, length of ICU stay, heart rate, and delta T interval obtained with photoplasmography. Comparing with the accuracy of a page 2, the photoplasmography plus epidemiological variable was similar, but the multivariate logistic model with inclusion of page 2 showed the larger area. In the model using artificial neural network, the accuracy was greater. Conclusion The mortality model using variables obtained with photoplasmography with the inclusion of epidemiological parameters are very accurate and if associated to a patch 2, improve prognostic accuracy. This tool is important to help in the clinical judgments of the intensivist.